Let's hear it, LA. Now, earlier we met the Mach E. Now, let's meet the newest pony in the stable. And here it is the all new seventh generation Ford Mustang. It's making its world debut this year. So, let's get this baby into the garage and break it down a little bit, shall we? What do you guys think of my garage? Pretty cool, right? 
<laughs> now, Mustang has always been the heart and soul of Mustang and Ford for generations, but it's also a vehicle that loves to switch things up, to challenge convention, to evolve for the next generation. And this vehicle, well, it's no different. I mean, it's built for the thrill of driving, and that's pure and simple. It has unstoppable attitude and a dose of exhilarating joy for your everyday. And I know that sounds simple, but years of work and millions of decisions have gone into achieving that goal. So I've invited a few expert guests to help join us so we can hear it directly from the horse's mouth. So to kick us off, let's welcome Ford Archivist, Ted Ryan. The new Mustang draws on its heritage because it's going to be fun to drive and it's going to be an amazing car. What is that heritage? Well, for almost six decades after it was introduced in April 1964, the Mustang has redefined what a sports car is. It's got elegance, it's got style, it's got beauty. Uh, who else would be featured in almost 10,000 movies? Uh, why? Because the Mustang was a different class. Thanks, Ted. Now, as Mustang honors its past, it also needs to forge its own path. So, let's meet our next 2024 Mustang Maven. Please welcome Chris Walter, Exterior Design Manager for Mustang. So, let's talk about some of the exterior design details. First and foremost, we have a unique front fascia, front grills for the 2.3 EcoBoost versus the GT. The GT is the halo of the brand, and it gets a larger upper grille and it gets a unique hood vent, and this differentiation will really help broaden the Mustang appeal. Sweet, right? Now we have to get to the interior, which you can get a sneak peek of on the drop top GT that we have over there. I mean, it blows my mind. It's completely different from any other Mustang. It feels driver centric and it has an incredible cockpit inspired by a jet fighter. And you can even get an electric drift brake, which is awesome because you can take advantage of all this rear wheel drive power. The team took advantage of every pixel and even used 3D gaming technology to design a smart, super driver-friendly digital experience. Speaking of our team, let's meet another team member. Please welcome Carrie Kennerly, Senior Coloring and Material Designer. Something that was very important to us, and I think that was very successful, is the introduction of new laser grains on the inside and the outside of the vehicle. Something else that I'm proud about is the introduction of seatbelt accents. It really doesn't seem like much, but having an asymmetric design on a seatbelt really is an added touch and a little bit of detail that I think the customer is looking for. I agree. I mean, the details are everything. And it's another way to honor the Mustang legacy by adding the unexpected. Mustang vehicle engineering manager, Eddie Kahn, to get to our main event. Mustang performance. As we set out to deliver the performance for seven generation Mustang, our key element was to ensure that we deliver the fun to drive aspect of the DNA and also the breadth of performance. What really means fun to drive for us that ensure that we deliver the acceleration, the responsiveness, and of course, the exhilarating sound of the Mustang. Listen, I can already hear the rumble of this engine. Now, there you have it, directly from the minds behind the sheet metal, the longest running muscle car nameplate in North America. First out of the stable with new style and improved performance. But I'm not done yet. We're gonna take a look at the power of the Mustang legacy. And that's how we dominate on the track. Check this out.
guys ever been in an electric vehicle? I before? have. He haven't. Okay. Awesome. Yeah. Awesome. Well, my name is Savannah, and this will be the new fully electric Lightning F one hundred and fifty. Oh it's dual motor, all wheel drive, and it goes uh -huh. zero to sixty in about four point five seconds. Get ready. We don't have quite enough room to hit sixty here, but I can definitely give you a good idea of what it's like. This would be great if I survived. <laughs> Beautiful. Than a truck, right? Yeah. <laughs> Reserve some for the foundlings. As it should always be, the foundlings are the future. This is the way. This is the way. This is the way. <laughs>